How's it going guys? This is Nick from barbend.com. Today I'm going to be trying out Perfotex BCAA plus glutamine. So Perfotech is a Florida-based company and although they sell collagen supplements and turmeric supplements, they're probably best known for uh, waist trimmers, these warming belts that come around the waist that are meant to help reduce belly fat. Um, but they also produce this particular BCAA brand. Um, this here is the tropical fruit flavor, so we're going to see how it tastes with water. Yeah, okay, it's good. Um, I was expecting like the tropical, like fruit punch flavor is the most common flavor of BCAAs. Normally it tastes like cherry and watermelon. This actually tastes like a tropical fruit juice. So um, it tastes more like pineapple, uh, mango, and a little bit of vanilla in it. Um, it's probably one of the most pleasant BCAAs I've tried actually. All right, so let's check out the nutrition and the ingredients. Uh, so I don't have any information about the calories on this one, um, but the, uh, the first three ingredients are the branch chain amino acids themselves, so uh, leucine, isoleucine, and valine. What's unusual about this is that while most BCAA supplements follow like a two to one to one or three to one to one ratio of leucine, isoleucine, and valine, this follows more of like a 12 to one to one ratio. So it's very, very high in leucine. Um, and you get about uh, seven, 7.2 grams of BCAAs in a serving. So it's higher than normal. Normally you get about five grams. Um, besides that, you get 2.5 grams of glutamine in every serving. Uh, and that's it for the main ingredients. Uh, besides that, you get tropical fruit natural flavor, uh, citric acid, that's probably for flavoring, sucralose, that's an artificial sweetener, it's also called Splenda. Then you get malic acids, also for flavoring, sodium chloride, I believe that's an anti-caking agent. Uh, then you get vanilla flavor, acid sulfate potassium, which is another artificial sweetener, uh, salt, and um, food dye color red number 40. So as far as the price goes, this little tub here will give you 30 servings and it costs $20 or $19.99. So that comes up to 66 cents per serving uh, or 9.2 cents per gram of BCAA because um, you get a little over seven grams of BCAAs per serving. Um, so this is actually probably the cheapest one, the cheapest BCAA I've seen besides BSN's Amino X, which is a little bit cheaper. Um, but most, the vast majority of BCAAs I've tried are more between like 10 and 12 cents per gram of BCAA, um, more like 11 and 12 cents. So this is very, very inexpensive. So what I really liked about BCA plus glutamine, it, it really is probably the best tasting BCA I've tried. Um, it, uh, it doesn't contain any soy, which a lot of people try and avoid in their health supplements. Um, it's got, uh, it's very, very, very inexpensive and you get a nice big serving size. You get seven, more than seven grams of BCA per serving. Normally you get about five. So I, I like that touch. What I didn't like quite so much about BCA plus glutamine, um, first of all, uh, it does contain acid sulfate, potassium, and sucralose, which are artificial sweeteners that are controversial in some circles. Um, they're pretty widely accepted though by the scientific community. Um, but uh, it also contains uh, glutamine, which um, while it's kind of popular as a supplement, there's really not much evidence that it actually helps you build muscle. It's already the most abundant amino acid in the body, and even when you consume extra, amino, uh, extra glutamine, almost all of it gets stored in your gut and doesn't get to the muscles. Um, it's, it's really a very ineffective supplement. Um, and finally, uh, the 12 to 1 to 1 ratio of BCAAs, it's, it's not a very good thing, uh, in my opinion. Leucine is the amino acid that's m uh, most strongly linked to muscle protein synthesis. So a lot of people think it's a good idea to have a lot of leucine in a supplement, um, in a BCAA supplement. Um, however, uh, there was a study from Baylor University that showed that um, when you compare leucine, uh, like a straight leucine supplement with a BCAA with a two to one to one ratio, um, that's actually more effective at muscle protein synthesis. Uh, in addition to that, the isoleucine and the valine are better at helping your endurance and focus during a workout. Um, so I don't think it's as, as effective a supplement as if it had the classic two to one to one or three to one to one ratio. All right guys, those are my thoughts on Perfectex uh, BCAA plus glutamine supplement. For the full review, you can check out the link below at barbin.com.